Let's kick things off over at Heisey Park where it's Brennan South and the Clear Fork Colts going on the road and doing some damage. They get the big win. South though, 25 of 36 through the air, 264 yards and a touchdown. Really special game on the ground though. They ran a bunch of options, 24 carries for the quarterback, 85 yards and three touchdowns. He also had the game clinching fumble recovery at the end of the game. So just the senior, he showed out in a big time game on the road. I love it. Yeah, when he plays well, they play well. And what impresses me is how hard of a runner he is for, the, for, for not having much size. Yeah, coach said after the game he's about 135 pounds in all of his gear, but he ran real hard last night. A big reason why Clear Fork was able to get the win on the road, handing Galleon their first loss. Cam Todd, the Mansfield senior, senior quarterback, efficient again, 8 of 13 through the air, 148 yards and a score, 10 carries, 58 yards and a touchdown as the offense racks up 467 yards. Effie, he's just been consistent each week. I, I feel like he's growing with each passing game. He is. It's amazing how you watch that offense grow, but how simple they've made it for him. You know, you would think they grow because they get more complicated, but in actuality, they're making it more simple. They're giving him more easier reads. He's got right. one guy, one guy to read. He's pulling the ball when, in, when he's supposed to. He's making solid runs. He's no, he's not, he may not be a home run hitter from the, as a running back, but the threat of him pulling the ball and making significant gain is something that you got to, yet another thing that you got to prepare for mm -hmm. uh, when you're playing the Tigers. So he, he's just having a great year, and I think he's grown each week. And he's got his team off to a 6-0 and start. Tommy Zerzow, the Lucas running back and linebacker, 22 carries, 184 yards, and five touchdowns in one game for him as the Cubs rush for 347 yards in this game. Just having a guy that takes Pater five times, that's pretty cool. Yeah, I mean, if, you know, if you're doing fantasy points, I think he won the week. Yeah. I mean, when you get in the end zone that much. But when you're at Lucas, man, like, I think if you're born and you're a running back, it's like, you, you know, you're, you're going to be, you're just, you're tougher than a $2 steak, man. You know what I mean? Like, these guys are just incredible. I just, I appreciate how hard those guys play and week to week playing kind of unknown competition around the state because of the fact they're searching to fill their schedule, but they continually find teams, they continually beat people, and they have people like this that are just doing a great job. Yeah, the senior special night, five touchdowns for Zerzow in the win. Caleb Galwitz of East Knox. You want to talk about fantasy football points. 24 carries, 265 yards on the ground for him. And then he also got into the end zone four times for the Bulldogs to remain undefeated at 6-0. But what's most impressive to me is they went on the road homecoming night against an undefeated team in Northmore. And this kid lit them up. It's, it's a lot like what we talked about earlier with, uh, with Galleon. If you come in on the road mm -hmm. and you're ready to play, there's a, there's a lot to be said about being ready to play. And you got a kid who has a night like he did, getting into the end zone, doing all doing everything on the football field. You're going to have a great chance to win. And that's an outstanding night for an individual performer, no matter what level you're playing at. Got involved on the defensive side, too, as they hold the Golden Knights scoreless. Bulldogs shut out Northmore 41 to nothing. Wrap things up here with Cooper Graham, the River Valley junior running back slash linebacker. He had a special performance all over the field. 13 carries, 70 yards, and a score. Two defensive interceptions, too. Took one of them back, 67 yards for a touchdown. So he was getting involved offense, defense, big time shutout win. Yeah, it might have been the most complete player that we have on the list this week. Uh, you, you, you love the two-way players. That's what's great about high school football is your best athletes are playing both ways, especially the smaller the school, your best have to play. And to have that kind of a night, I guarantee you after the game is over, he probably had an ice bath. As they went 34 to nothing on the road at Ontario Graham, big time performance.